been several reports on differences in survival after COVID-19 between different population subgroups, with males and older individuals often experiencing worse outcomes. However, little is known about the prevalence of underlying conditions between those who have died from COVID-19, particularly between sexes, and how these compare with non-COVID-19 related deaths. My name is Dr. Mohamed Mohamed, and I'm a Doctor Research Fellow in Cardiology in Keele University, United Kingdom. I'm delighted to summarise today the findings from our most recent study entitled Sex Differences in Mortality Rates and Underlying Conditions for COVID-19 Deaths in England and Wales, which is due to be published in the October 2020 issue of Mayo Clinic Proceedings. This was a retrospective cross-sectional study that included all adult deaths in England and Wales between the 1st of March and 12th of May 2020, stratified by the primary cause of death into COVID-19 and non-COVID-19 confirmed deaths, and further by sex and age group. Adult deaths recorded during the study period were just in excess of 144,000 cases, of which 25.3% or approximately 1 in 4 were due to confirmed COVID-19. The age standardised mortality for COVID-19 was persistently higher in men than in women across all age groups, but was more pronounced with advanced age. Approximately in 1 in 3 deaths had no underlying conditions, but this was similar between the COVID-19 and non-COVID-19 groups, and also between sexes. This raises a question as to why men and older individuals experience worse outcomes after COVID-19. Several theories have been discussed in detail in our manuscript, as well as in other recent publications. The most prevalent reported conditions amongst COVID-19 deaths in our study were hypertension, dementia, chronic lung disease and diabetes, in keeping with previous reports. Interestingly, we show that pre-existing ischemic heart disease was similar in prevalence between COVID-19 and non-COVID-19 deaths, arranged between 11 to 12 percent. Unlike that reported in some previous reports that were based on small case series or single centre experiences. On comparison, we find that COVID-19 infection was associated with a higher age standardised mortality than all other common primary causes of death during the study period except for cancer in women of select younger age groups. We believe that our findings add to the body of literature on age differences and sex differences in patterns of death after COVID-19 from a population with a high mortality rank and emphasise the need for further research into underlying mechanisms that could explain these sex differences. Furthermore, we hope that our findings better inform stakeholders and government policies when identifying high-risk groups that could benefit from prolonged shielding, especially in the event of a resurgence in COVID-19 cases, or um, vaccination priority in the future, should this become available. Thank you. We hope you found this presentation from the content of our website valuable. Our journal's mission is to promote the best interests of patients by advancing the knowledge and professionalism of the physician community. If you are interested in more information about us, our homepage is www.mayoclinicproceedings.org. There you'll find access to information for our social media content, such as additional videos on our YouTube channel or journal updates on Facebook. You can also follow us on Twitter more information about Healthcare at Mayo Clinic is available at www.mayoclinic.org. This video content is copyrighted by Mayo Foundation for Medical Education and Research.